uh, let's go to uh, Delano de Souza, who's standing by uh, at the headquarters of Emmanuel Macron's uh, Ensemble Party, where the Prime Minister Elisabeth Borne is uh, waiting to see how she fared in Normandy. That's right, Elizabeth Bourne, who has never run for elected office here in France. Now, as those results uh, came in, 25.2 uh, percent, both uh, the, the left-wing coalition as well as the center-right coalition of uh, Ensemble or together, clearly neck and neck. So things clearly up in the air. We will have to wait and see how the evening progresses to see how those sitting ministers are performing in their constituencies, uh, because they have essentially uh, staked their jobs on the line. They have to win these parliamentary polls. Uh, Either tonight or outright tonight, or by by in the second round next week, uh, to to remain in their jobs. So we will see how the night progresses. Many thanks, Delano de Souza, and we'll be crossing back again live when the prime minister speaks. Let's now head south to the port city of uh, Marseille. Cole Stangler has been following uh, the campaign of the top lieutenant of Jean-Luc Mélenchon, Manuel uh, Bompard, who's uh, certainly hoping to get a good result, but also hoping that this new coalition will be able to become the main opposition force and maybe more. Yeah, that, that, that's right, Mark. You know, we just heard uh, audible uh, applause uh, just in the room next to me when we had those projections that first go up. So people here are clearly uh, pretty enthused uh, about these projections, which again are just projections. And they're really less concerned about the seat projections, which as we've been hearing again and again, um, it's first, this is a two round vote. Second, uh, these, these are just projections. Um, but the, if you look at the actual percent numbers, you have NUPES, the, the new popular union coalition, and Macron's uh, uh, coalition running neck and neck. That's seen as a very good result uh, for, for the, the left so far, and we'll see how this plays out later in the evening. Just to give you a sense here of Bonpa, who's expected to speak later, he's saying now, uh, again, this is this is uh, from Twitter, that uh, uh, they'll be in the second round in more than 500 districts across the country, uh, and that they're the first political force in the country, again, according to this, this is Bonpa's uh, uh, point of view. But a very good result, uh, a very good projection, I should say, for, for the Nupes coalition that wanted to be in as many of these uh, uh, second round matchups as possible, and it looks like the percentage that they have right now is going to get them into a fair amount of these. And again, we'll have to see how things progress throughout the evening. Cole Stangler will check with you once the results are in, in Marseille. Uh, obviously, for uh, Manuel Bompard, it's an important uh, race.